And as numbers continue to decline, doctors at Henry Ford say now is not the time to let up on precautions. And that includes why people should not have the mindset of thinking they're going to get it anyway. Priya Mann live tonight with their warning. Priya. Yeah, Devin Kim, if you just feel like you might as well get COVID at this point, doctors say think again. Scientists are still trying to learn about long COVID. And tonight we talked to a man who's been suffering with symptoms for more than a year, going from being an active hands on dad to suffering from chronic fatigue. We tried to do as much as we could, but we ended up still getting it anyway. And for me, it just never went away. Jeff and Allison Whitmer got COVID in 2020. While Allison recovered within several days, more than a year later, Jeff still has symptoms. I just never really got better. As COVID cases trend downward, Henry Ford Health System is sounding the alarm about long COVID, a disease they say can be worse than the initial illness. Research suggests that 10 to 50 percent of patients experience persistent symptoms more than four weeks after recovering even if they weren't very sick in the first place. Symptoms of long COVID can range from severe fatigue, cognitive dysfunction and mobility issues. Medical experts are warning people against trying to intentionally get COVID, thinking it will add a layer of protection. Most people recover, but we cannot tell you who is going to come into the hospital, who is going to die, who's going to have long term complications of COVID. Now that vaccines are available, Jeff is hoping others will protect themselves after dealing with long COVID for 14 months. The problem is I'm still not getting better and I still can't do what I used to do. And I would really like to get back to doing a lot of those things. Now there is a bit of a silver lining here. If you are vaccinated and boosted, doctors say it's extremely rare that you will experience long COVID symptoms. Uh, however, they continue to reiterate right now, your best bet is to keep your guard up and of course, get vaccinated. Reporting live tonight, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4.